Okay, so it is Saturday. It is Saturday, July 29th. That means there's two days left to this month. Uh, it is about 3.30, and I have to head out down to San Pedro again for the last day filming on the battleship. And then uh, I got to film all night long, and then I got to um, try and get a couple hours of sleep because I got to be down in um, Anaheim tomorrow for a very important meeting that my manager set up at noon. So I explained to him, I said, please tell the woman that I'm meeting with that I will be exhausted from filming all night long. Um, some people have been, I know there's one crew member that was sleeping on the boat that they had a room. So I'm wondering if I asked them if I could sleep for like a couple hours, they'll just let me, I'll rush down there to the meeting. Um, also I may just stay at the hotel, uh, just because I'm exhausted. I don't want to keep driving back and forth because I do know that on Monday we're supposed to be filming really, really, really far away. And I think instead of driving back home and then driving out, like driving up, up and then back over, I'll just be down here and kind of go up. So I don't know. Um, but there's a lot of crazy craziness going away today. I, today I slept most of the day. That's why my vlog is starting so late, but I gotta rush down now to set. Well, I'm not going to rush, but definitely going to drive down there and I'm gonna stop at my Starbucks again. And then, um, it's Saturday, but it's still saying it's gonna take a long time to get there. So I don't, this city is insane. So wish me luck. <laughs> I'm leaving Starbucks. Like I'm always leaving a Starbucks. I have to tell you, I got, I became gold status member a few years ago because when I had my play produced, my mom got me a $50 gift card to Starbucks so I could go and write more basically. Uh, and so I would go all the time and then I just got gold status. I even have a gold, little gold card. I don't know if they give it out anymore. But um, I've managed to keep my status all of these years, which is kind of nice. Hold on, I have my hands full of stuff here. But um, uh, I'm about to head to set right now. Oh, I don't want my napkins to fly away. Hold on. Hold on, hold on. I gotta undo the car. Okay. Okay, so I'm about to head to set. And uh, I actually had a really good phone call with Kevin from Riker because um, we actually, I just want to say thank you to everybody because we succeeded our goal of getting 100 new backers. And so um, I just want to say how grateful I am to everybody who who contributed or at least don't if not if, if you didn't contribute at least getting the word out for us i had so many people tag me in posts and were sharing it and it's like i'm so grateful because i'm really excited about this project it's gonna be a lot of fun i think and i'm excited to share it with you guys and i'm excited to like vlog about it like i do with everything else so so thank you for that so i had a good call with um kevy but now i gotta get on the freeway i gotta get to this battleship and finish the last day on this movie uh, i'm not directing this one i'm just crew and so it's just been like really, really long and exhausting. And we're going to be there at 5 p.m. and going to film all night long. So oh, I'm exhausted. But I'm excited because a lot, a lot of people have work. And um, I'm grateful to have like all these back-to-back -back projects. And I have gotten called for like four more gigs. So uh, the good thing is if I can't do it, I, I know people that need work. And I'm so utterly grateful that I can get people work. So thank you, Lord, for that. Um, and okay, everybody. Uh, on the set I go and I'm gonna eat my little sandwich. I always get the little um, turkey pesto sandwich from from Starbucks because I really like it. Hi, Nash. I'm taking a video because we never see you work. Oh, my dirty shirt. <laughs> I'm just fucking with you. All right, there's another shot for that right there. Here's the front of the ship. Have a good shoot, guys. We'll see you from on top. So today is one of the Grips boys' birthday. Christian, who I think is cool, is really cool. He lives in um, Phoenix. So now that whenever I go to Phoenix, I'm going to try to meet up with him. But it's cool. But today, I just found out it's his birthday. So <clears throat> Malcolm convinced me to get him something from DoorDash. So I ordered some smoothies. That's what he wanted. I was going to get coffee, but they didn't want coffee because we have coffee here. So one of the smoothies. So I got him, I got me, him, Malcolm, and one of the other Grip Boys smoothie. So I'm waiting for DoorDash to arrive. So I'm standing here by the gate. But we met, so these these really nice guys on board. You can see them right there. You can't really see them, but they're right there. They do reenactment stuff, but they are here on the weekends. And they live on the ship, and they're restoring it. And they're actually very nice, and they're giving us a lot of history about this ship. And apparently, this is a... A civilian merchant vessel 
maybe this is what I'm saying, but it, it held cargo. And so these big, these big um, things right here, those are cranes. If I can do it, I can't do it because I'm doing upside. But anyways, that big thing there's a crane. There's a bunch of them. Um, so there's two places where they have cargo, and then this tall thing right here, right there, apparently can lift a can lift a tank, and then they can lift it over onto the side. And then because they were saying during the war, um, because if you had if you're the cargo vessel, you had like ammo and food and stuff. And so that's why it has guns. Because, so the Navy would be on board because it would be the ships that were attacked first because they had supplies. So he said there's eight little guns on board that are anti-aircraft. And then there's these two big ones at the end on each end. So I learned some stuff. But anyways, I got to go because the door dash is going to be here and I got to make sure I can find it. Okay. So. Oh my God, that's so noisy. Okay, so I asked... Um, the guy that worked on the on the boat and I was like, look, we're going to wrap it like five or six in the morning. I got to be in Orange County by like noon, but I don't have anywhere to sleep. And I want to get a hotel for a couple of hours because I have this important meeting that Matt set up for me, my manager. And so I talked to the guy on the boat and they're going to give me a room for a few, about four hours, which is kind of cool. So I'm going to get going to the car right now, take my other jacket because it's cold and my overnight bag and put it in my room. But yeah, I have a room. I'm gonna crash in. See if we even wrap it like five or six. I'll just go up to my room, lay down for about four hours, head down to Orange County. And I also booked a room down there because I don't wanna keep driving everywhere. And even though it's gonna be a long ride home, I've just decided I'm gonna stay down there in Orange County and get a room. And then I'll just drive from there out to the desert where we're filming. So I have an overnight bag, but yeah, I've never slept on a battleship. I think it's gonna be a lot of fun. All right, here's my little room for the next 11 hours. I'm not sleeping in here just yet, but this is the room. It's kind of cool, huh? It's a little closet, which I can't put anything in. It's got a window. This is actually kind of cool. But this will give me a couple hours to just sleep before I uh, head out. This is exciting. This is actually an angle of a cruise ship, or of a battleship I've never seen before. So that's kind of cool. Oh, that's terrifying. They're actually climbing up on the side right there? Oh, I can't see. Okay. So I just climbed up out of that boat. On top of the, I'm the little ladder. I'm not used to doing that stuff, so that was a bit terrifying. But I did it. And the day is almost over. There's fireworks everywhere. Anyways, I'm gonna sign off because the day is almost over. We're at lunch now. I'm gonna go eat. I'm gonna go eat real quick. Cause I'm starving. I hear we have tacos. I'm really excited about that. So I go up the gameplay right here. Go have lunch. And then we start the second half of the day, which is technically into the new day. So, ah. All right, hope everybody had a good Saturday and let's start the new week strong.